Good morning, my friends. This is Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works, and I am your Sunday blogger, Rosemary. Welcome. Happy 4th of July, my friends. It is going to be a hot weekend, let me tell you. Our temperature yesterday almost got to 120, and it is still climbing. It is like in the 90s, and it is only 8 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> so, uh, it's going to be hot. So, uh, this is a great question for the way the w weather is uh, topic, summertime. You and a bathing suit. Has your life changed with regard to wearing a bathing suit to the pool, beach, or party since weight loss surgery? How has it changed? New suit? Different suit? You actually do wear a suit? And uh, if you notice, I am wearing one. And I will show you, but you got to stay to the end. <laughs> Let me answer the question. Has your life changed with regard to wearing a bathing suit? Oh, yes, my friends, very much so. I don't have very many before pictures, but I'll show you what I used to look like in case you don't know. And it'll go right here. Well, you can imagine what I used to wear. Uh, I have two children, two girls, and um, I loved swimming. And believe it or not, uh, we would go to the lake in Dallas, and uh, I would be wearing a dress. Yes, and it was a blue jean dress. And it was uh, just a big, big dress that I would wear, a flowy dress, and I would get in the in the water that way. I loved it. I didn't care if the, if the, if the dress was climbing up. You know, I, 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 I wore uh, shorts on the bottom as best as I could. I didn't, it's not like I had a choice. Um, shorts never really fit me. Pants never really fit me. Um, I know that's hard to believe, but back then, I was raised in the 70s, and uh, I, I'm from 1962, so I'm 51 years old. And it was okay. Um, we just went with a church group, and they knew that I, you know, and my sister, you know, we just wore what we could. Um, it was fun. Uh, there was a time where uh, we weren't as big as we got, um, and we did try and find some pants to fit us, and they were army pants. And uh, that didn't last very long. I think that that was we, they were tight on us to begin with and we were ready to get out of them pants um, so uh, even though I enjoyed swimming I never got the pleasure of wearing a bathing suit and I've always been kind of modest so never have wanted to show my legs I think if I had great legs I would show them <laughs> but uh, I've got the elephant knees that my mama used to call them elephant knees and I've heard other people call them that so anyway um so I will show you uh, what I look like in my bathing suit as soon as I finish answering the question. <laughs> I know y'all are just so anxious. Uh, has your life changed? Of course it has. Um, now uh, I do go to the pool and beach. I've been maybe twice to the beach. Uh, haven't been, it's kind of cold where in the beaches that I've been to here in California. So I've not really wore a suit to the beach. Uh, or a party. I've been to a party and I've been modest and wore my, my cover-up. I always wear a cover-up. Even though I'm wearing uh, the bathing suit, I wear a cover-up. Uh, how has it changed? A new suit, different suit. It's actually a different suit. I am blessed to just go and find them at the thrift. And uh, I've been blessed to find Speedos. And uh, Speedos are my thing. Now, my sister just gave me this. Usually, I will wear a... Um, strapless bra with my, uh, to, you know, to hoist them up. <laughs> it, I wear a strapless bra underneath my bathing suit. My sister purchased me this and brought it to me brand new. It is a Speedo. And uh, when we were in Las Vegas, she brought it to me for this summer. And uh, it is a little big. It's a size 12. I'm a size 8, 10 in this. And um, it looks fine on me. I'm not saying it doesn't look fine on me, but uh, they would be hoisted up a little bit better uh, if, they, if it was a smaller size. But the thing is, is that I have such a round bottom that I, I need a, a, a little bigger size. So anyway, she found this at, I believe, at a thrift or, or at an outlet or some sort. 
and uh, she wanted me to have it. So thank you, Connie. You're such a sweetie, such a great sister. Now, with further ado, I will show you what I look like. <laughs> you can tell I'm just so anxious to show you guys. Well, this is my cover-up. Oops, I don't even know if I'm showing you. This is my cover-up that I wear that I also found at a thrift. It is a actual, it is a skirt. And I walk around the beach or, or the party that I'm going to be at, and this is what I look like. Yes, you, did, you guys, did you really think I was going to show you my legs? I never show anybody my legs but my husband. And this is what I mean about wearing a, a, a smaller size. Uh, but it's, it's loose enough to where it's fine. I'm comfortable in it. But it's, I, I really need a size 10, I think. I would feel, I would feel, it, whoops. Sorry, guys. This would feel tighter, and this would be up higher. And, of course, I know how to fix that. I can just pin it up. But um, this is what I look like in my bathing suit, guys. Um, I, I'll show you what I mean about my legs. I'm going to have to put you down some, somewhat. All right. See, my knees, they're very, like, wide. And, I mean, everybody has issues with something, right? Everybody has issues with something. This is what I look like. But, um, you know, the flappy sides. You have to find a bathing suit that, that's comfortable for you. And uh, Sally showed us uh, a few years ago that she wore shorts with her bathing suit. And, you know, it just ding, ding, ding. A bell came on and I said, oh, I've got those. I can wear those. And so that's what I've been doing. I wear them to go to the beach or I to the I do want to add this. That, you know, now that I can wear a bathing suit, I want to enjoy this moment. Enjoy the moments, my friends. Enjoy the time that you are able to get into a bathing suit. And, you know, I remember the times when I couldn't do it. So this is a, a fun time for me. Um, you know, I, I appreciate my sister. She knows my, my body. She knows my size. Uh, she'll, you know, be rambling uh, at a store and find something for me and send it to me. What a blessing, right? That's, that's a huge blessing for me. You know, because I'm not going to pay $100 for a Speedo. You guys know what a Speedo cost. And um, so, you know, she'll find them on sale or whatever, and she'll think of me. So I'm just so blessed uh, for that. But what I was going to also say is that in this particular case, she found me one that I'm not going to have to wear my other uh, bra with this. But I am going to be I am going to be able to like hoist it up and it'll be perfect. So do what you can with what you have. Uh, and enjoy your body. Enjoy it. You know, remember that there was a time where we didn't enjoy. So this is the time to enjoy our bodies as we're losing the weight, as we're exploring more things in our lives, you know, be blessed, be thankful, be grateful. That's all I'm trying to say. I wanted to add that. Clingy to my skin so I'm comfortable in the pool with them. And um, I hope I answered the question. I'm at seven minutes and uh, I love you guys. Be comfortable. Wear what you feel good in and uh, cover up what you want to cover up. And if you don't want to cover up, don't cover up. <laughs> Embrace. Embrace. That's the point. Embrace what you have. Accentuate what you, what you, what you like about your body. And uh, enjoy it. Life is too short, my friends. I love you, and I'll be back next Sunday. You go be proof that weight loss surgery works. For you. Bye for now.